love bugs is rousing back at you one more again i hope everybody is doing blessed i'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time to talk to my channel much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs my grown extended beautiful family as always thank you for, so much for the love and support it is truly truly appreciated so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already please drop a line out would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me and if the videos truly resonate with what you're going through or really understand and appreciate what what kind of uh, vibrations you got out of the content please go ahead and share it'll be greatly appreciated so um you know always send the love and light you know anybody who's coming to be ill well and you're trying to wish something on me return back to sender except it's going to be love healing light and blessings uh coming towards your way the video I'm doing right now is called Twin Flame Model 1. Hey, Okas, the confusion is starting to make perfect sense to a beautiful clarity. It is, you know, there are so many different things that we're going through day by day. You know, you're really trying to understand, you know, hey, I don't have control over my life. You know, I'm just, you know, trying to allow myself to adapt to the new me. You know, because a lot of times it's just basically what we're going Because I'm like, Raza, how you know what I'm going through? I'm going through the same thing. It's just we're all going through that moment of where we have been on the same vibe for a continuous, you know, extended period of time. And then when you get to that point where you see that whatever is going on in your life, you're not fully fulfilled. You know, it's being unbearable, uncomfortable. You're just not happy. You're miserable. And it's just like that was when that moment comes was where what do I need to do? to transform that what do i need to do when it, it just makes me feel like life is just worth living even though you it was like you may be in that vibe life worth living but it's just your actions the way you choose to do things the way you you know what you what your interests are you know the people you hang around it, it can really contradict what you're saying and it would be just the moments where it's just like what do i have to do and it's just like that time is like universe is telling you free will you know you've been trying to do things on your own for the longest now it's time for you to you know allow us to assist you because it's like a lot of time we don't realize when we're trying to you know things is just taking a little bit too much time we be trying to cut corners and i realize you know it can really truly backfire you can really mess up your blessings when you're doing that you're when you're doing things and it's not for uh you know for the highest good of yourself you know you're doing things you're saying things you're thinking things all of uh things that are just in a low vibration where they're you know really guiding you to change that you know there's so much better in the world that you can have if we allow change and not resist change and a lot of times it's hard to be able to do that because it'll be you you can really be going through something and it'll be everything that comes out your mouth and every vibration is something negative you know and it's hard when you're going through so many different things it's not one or two things you're probably dealing with 12 different things at once and it's all coming at you like quarterbacks you could be you know a a a, 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 a miniature thing of a, like a shrimp you know i mean not a shrimp but a smurf and you got all these like these quarterbacks like from you know uh the uh what is it the oh, god dog i don't even know clips and tigers or something like that i don't really be dealing with football like that but you know uh new york the Wins, i don't want to say new york lord that's not even but you know what i'm saying there's, there's some big 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 things coming towards you in your way and you're really trying to allow yourself to really deal with you know the mishaps that are going on in your life and a lot of times can be very overwhelming and unbearable you know and it can be in a very uncomfortable place and it's just like hey you need to get out your comfort zone i'm looking around me and i'm in world war 20 i'm not in a comfort zone yes you are how am i in a comfort zone i don't like where i'm at is miserable i feel like i'm in hell i'm in a nightmare you can't wake up from you know and you know this this and this and this and this it is just because the fact is when you're and i had to use the really dumb it down dot com for me just say you're in a comfort zone because the fact is you allowed yourself to adapt to a situation where th it, it was supposed to be over by now and it's just the fact is you have gotten into that state of mind where you feel like it can never go past this and universe is telling you give yourself that chance it can go so much worth past past this and it's just like when you start getting complacent you don't move they start alienating up and like oh okay you still don't want to move okay you want to be complacent and you want to do it well okay why don't we start snatching this and this and that or why don't we start giving you all this heartache and karma and, and all these other different things or why don't you you know we keep on giving you these signs we need to do this and you keep going on your way and you want to do this how about is really about to get real and then your understanding it start making more sense when i allow myself to start doing them changes that you know not me being hard-headed and, and listen to the signs because i already tell people all the time and i had to tell myself that if you don't start you don't start taking heed of what universe is telling you and you don't do that if they make you do it baby it ain't gonna be something nice 
Because it's like, okay, I keep telling you, I keep telling you, keep telling you, and you don't change for your life. These are the things that's like, a lot of times you're making conundrums out of something that's very, you know, uh, what do you call it? Uh, very simple. You know, I was looking looking for some uh, another word, but I can't think of it. But a lot of different things is telling you, and it's just like sometimes it, you know we can even feel bad when we we go through things, and it's very repetitive. And it's just like, why are you allowing yourself? You don't realize a lot of times the choices that we make in certain situations. That's the reason why the cycle keeps going on and on and on. And it's like the more you allow yourself to ignore it and it keeps happening, the worse it gets the next time I go around. And those are the time time you have to be able to take yourself out that hamster loop. Like, no, I want better for my life. I'm tired of going through this situation and it ain't getting better. And this is at a time we're just waiting for you to realize that. You know, that was the place of resistance again. And these are the different things things is showing you you know a lot of times we make it harder than what it is and it's just like you know you'll be looking at simple things and when you really allow yourself to get out your feelings and a lot of times it depends on what it is you got to woo meditate you know speak to yourself journal you know talk to somebody that you really truly uh trust that you can trust with your life or whatever and then just you know somebody who you know that will give you the benefit of the doubt be that voice of reason for you and um you know, will really speak life into your life when you really going through a, a is like a mercy. You know, mercy. I'm like, oh my God, I'm just ready to, you know, just end it all because I'm so tired of everything. Everything is just so great. Everything got to be so heavy, and we don't realize just the way we keep looking at it. That's what we're manifesting, and it's just like. You, okay, you you need these these brighter things into your life. You need to start bringing life into your life. What you know? What are, what are you wanting to see to come out of it? I want to be able to have patience in my life. I want to be able to create create more love in my life so I can be able to show other people I went through this and allowed me to love my life. And you know, I want to be more projective out towards other people, but do it in a positive way, a loving way. And it's just like you don't realize. And a lot of times I say it, but sometimes we need that gentle reminder. You just don't realize what you're going through may be a situation situation that can really make you a better person and then being able to share your your life situation with other people because it's just like a lot of times you you know you, you some of us are just now realizing we're an empath you're like are there other people i met i'm like rise people come up to me i could be at work you know I'll smoke break <laughs> whatever and i'll have total strangers just come up and you know just tell me their life story and i'm like well, why are you telling me this i don't know you and i really don't care and it's just like you don't understand your earth angel it's like what is that you know you're coming here to heal the world you're changing that within changing yourself and if people are doing that it may be some i'll say you got a question on your mind she's like actually i got a couple do you realize you answered the question by just somebody coming to them it's like you answered their prayers and they answered yours it's like that's really what that is yeah and why you know you can come into a room and then all of a sudden your energy will shift and you'll notice a big difference between certain things or or all of a sudden you'll feel an energy shift within yourself and not realize that you're taking on somebody else's energy and this is where you need to shield yourself it's like all these situations are making sense on why things are going the way they are because it's allowing you to know a part of yourself that was unknowledgeable you didn't know it was there and it's just like i was waiting for you and you're like well, who are you i'm a part of you that was waiting for you to just come connect you're like can we be friends you know <laughs> what's your snap you know it'd be one of those different things and it's really trying to really 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 allowing you to really understand th these things are going on for a reason this is going to be a benefit for you in so many unexpected ways it'll be beautiful things and it'll just be like when you finally get to where you get in this or past where you assumed that you were going to be you're going to understand why these things had to happen the way it did you know because there's a lot of times you go through stuff and it's just like okay whatever you're lacking is what situations you're going to be placed in if you're the person you know they just don't have patience <laughs> you know just don't have patience with yourself don't have patience with other people and these are those times where you're going to be put in positions where you have no other choice but to be patient on different things i mean that is a killer that's a little killer for me and what are you doing <laughs> being patient <laughs> like i don't like it i don't like it it's just not good for my health you know it'll be one of those different moments and then it's just like if you're that situation where every time something changes up and it's like you can do it it's like no i can't you know and it's like yes you can no i can't you know I, I never did this before but have you tried anything new but i don't like that that's the whole point i'm putting something in there new for you to even do while you're scared because i know they always say you know even if you're scared on doing it doing it when you're scared because the fact is you'll get no you get so scared you have no point but to do it and then it'll be like okay it's over and done with how do you feel and you'll be shocked like 
that's all that 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 was you know it's like yeah and it was just like i was so scared to do it ain't know how it was you know it'll be just like well i don't even want to say bungee jumping because ain't no way heck you can get me to do it <laughs> it was like no let me not use that it'll be okay like little kids were you know i was that person that would be terrified to get a shot and not realize it'll be one of them little pricks but when you seen it as a child your child it's like you put bringing a machete to me and it'll be one of those points that you don't riled yourself up and that stick t feels 10 times worse than what it actually is and even well there are, i know there's some adults to be terrified of that and i'm like how you gonna be terrified of that and you got about 20 piercings and you got like about 50 daggone tattoos and then you get scared because you need a shot you know, I, I, no, no, mm -mm. be one of those situations. So it's just like all the different things that we're going through. Universe is allowing us to be able to make that, you know, make us become better because it's like so many different things that are coming up to the surface. And when I say it's like, it's unbearable. It, it can be, it can be bad. <laughs> yeah, let me just put it that way. It can be bad. But it, it's like you're going through these learning experiences to grow. You're learning about yourself in different ways that you didn't know it was possible. But just be able to understand yourself in so many different levels. You know, getting to know yourself all over again. Because it's just like it seemed like in situations, it's always rerouting you to yourself. It's like, well, you need to learn yourself. You know, you need to heal yourself. You need to let go of this. You know, let go into that. And it'll be something that'll be in a state of confusion and not realizing it's just the way we keep allowing allowing ourselves to not change that perspective that's really the reason why it does that so when we allow ourselves to give ourselves that second chance and say hey let me reroute myself and try to look at it from a different direction and maybe it'll make perfect sense to what i i, I mean that i just really was like dead not wanting to see it you know sometimes we can be dead stuck like i don't want to see it that way did you ever think about it like that and it's just like that's what you were trying to tell me could be sometimes i'm like feel stupid <laughs> because it'll be like i be really wanting to know something and it'll be the answer right there and then universal bring something up whether you know it's a post or bring something you talking to your friend on the phone or even you're talking to yourself or you're just you know journaling and you're just really getting your feels out boom they say you know you have an answer right there so anything that you're going through that may, may be putting you in a state of confusion you know, um, I truly understand, but it's just like sometimes we gotta just really take a breather and you know, stop trying to allow ourselves and our mind to take on, on so many different things. Just being able to be selective. Let me take on one thing first and let, let it go from there. And just be able to allow yourself to do that. So I hope you are able to resonate with content in the video. Sometimes when I do these little short videos, it feels so awkward to me. But hey, it is what it is. You know, you don't always have to elongate everything like that. You can just say what you need to go and then on to the next thing. So I hope you are able to resonate with content in this video, y'all. Like I said, I'll leave my post. No, I said my post. My contact information in the description box below. Um, it's all about spiritual networking, you know, being able to get to know you on a spiritual level. You know, you may be going through different things or you're trying to have a deeper understanding about your path of purpose or certain things you've gone through. You may want insight on it about why it took place. You know, I try my best to be able to help out people the way I can and whatever we speak on is confidential. And I try to help away the best way I can. I don't know if I said that already, but I'm saying it again. Um, if you're interested in podcasts, I just dropped uh one earlier today i don't know when this daggone video gonna come out so hopefully it don't come out next week so <laughs> you know take the community section of my my channel i've just dropped one and hopefully be able to resonate with that or just be able to take something out of it you know um on whatever it is but i'll see you on my next video because it's like this i don't know this vibe got crazy for me but much love to you peace